Today we're gonna be checking out some people who got very lucky with food. So one of their chickens laid a 150 gram egg. Regular egg for comparison. Huge! Took her all day to lay this bad boy. Not the chicken coochie quivering all afternoon. <laughs> they was about to crack it and look! I thought it was gonna be like five yolks in that bad boy. No, it's a whole entire other egg. Boom! Double homicide! How do they make an egg inside of an egg? I'm so confused. It's like, yeah, you got your egg, the wet one, and then you also got a dry one. Plot twist. The other one is actually a chicken. <laughs> so this place is in South Carolina for only $8.99. And look at the amount of food they got. We got the rice, we got the pasta, like y'all closing or something? This ain't food for one person. This could literally feed a family of five. Oh, it's not even done. They gonna stack it up till it can't close no more. Ah, it don't close. Like I love when employees are not stingy with their food. Like feed me how you would want me to feed you. Not Chipotle with it. That dude is a real one. So he opened up a bag of Takis and he's gonna complain about the fat thing of spice that they gave him. Bro, this is a blessing. Put that in a salt and pepper shaker. Y'all got yourself some free Taki seasoning. She pulled out the biggest dang Lay's barbecue chip I have ever seen. I know she holding a family pack, but you see that face for comparison? And it do be looking extra crisp too, kind of looking like a chicken nuggy. Girl, smile. She don't even look too happy about it. Like, what is this? I can't even fit this in my mouth. We calling the manager tonight. I'm gonna speak to Mr. Lay's himself about this monstrosity in my chip bag. Mm. Cut it open. Ooh, what is that? Grapefruit? It's huge. A monstrosity. Tree gonna need a whole branch to hold this one up. Oh, it's a lemon? Ooh, the inside got a hole. It's hollow. Oh, where's that sweaty dude at? Grab me that lemon, sir. Oh my goodness, these gotta be the thickest mozzie sticks I have ever seen. Look, look at that cheese pull. Ooh, that ain't no mozzarella stick. That's a mozzarella rod. Mozzie monster. Where I gotta go to get me one of these? <gasps> that is one fat avocado. So round. Just give it a good Ooh. smack. And then they opened it up. And would you look at that? Compared to a regular avocado. Absolutely pathetic. Could make a whole bowl of guac out of that one half. Very nice. This dude walked up to a vending machine. Someone really wanted their smart pop. How many tries? And then this guy comes along to succeed where someone else had failed. That's all it took, just one more dollar. And then you get all of them for the price of one. What happened to the last dude who wasted five dollars trying to get himself a bag, eventually gave up? They pulled out this chip out of a bag of Doritos. Y'all see how thick this is? To me, this confirms that Doritos started out as a long thing. And then they just like slice it into chips. Don't be shy, take a bite. I wonder if it's crunchy or if it's like soft on the inside. Like a chalupa or something. The universe really wants me to be fat. So they opened up those little ice cream sandwich and you got a half. A whole and a half. A one and a half. How did you know there was gonna be more? I would've thought it was just like square shaped. I know you like these. I snuck in a little bonus. A little something extra for you. Was that an earthquake or did a TikTok vending machine hack actually work? Everything. Ejected. Did it malfunction? All right, but what if you want those Funyuns right there? You're gonna have to literally like pull out everything before you can like get what you actually want. I can't imagine walking in on this. Free snacks while the mods are asleep. Someone hit that glizzy jackpot with this pack of glizzies. They got a free one. Somehow snuck its way into the packaging. Buy six glizzies, get one free. Pretty good deal if you ask me. Have another large chip. Came from a big potato. I'ma have to deduct some points not being as big as the bag. But still quite impressive. I don't know if I would consider this lucky. But in their pack of waffle fries, they pulled out a whole entire uncut potato. Ma'am, what am I gonna do with this? This ain't a fry. Like y'all forgot to cut this one. I'm gonna have to send this back to the kitchen. Can y'all cut this up for me? When you ask for a Sunday and you get that good employee that's on TikTok, they recorded in a video so you know it's gonna be good. They ain't gonna be stingy with the mix-ins. Y'all see how many Oreos? You put half a pack in there. Pop it into that cone. Yes. Now that's some good cream. 10 out of 10 would scream. Huh? They poured, I wanna call these Cocoa Puffs so bad. The Nesquik cereal. And then it just, how are they all stuck together? That's not allowed. Cereal is not supposed to be doing that. I didn't want the whole box. Or did I? <laughs> Weird, I was just chilling there. All right, what happens when you pour the milk? I think that's when they'll like all start separating or something. 
Strawberries can grow in tons of weird different shapes, sizes. Every once in a while, you get an oddball. And then, yeah, they got a thumbs up strawberry. And the butt of it is the, the little thumb tip. That's literally a thumbs up. So many people have been coming here after this and like they ain't lying. It wasn't just like a one-off thing They're like we gonna show you how much we love our customers. We want to make sure y'all eat You know as long as the box closes we good This is how I like my buns extra sesamated. I don't even see no bun on that side mm, I put sesame seeds with everything when I say I want sesame seeds. This is what I mean not a little sprinkle Oh, no, no, no opens up a bag of jelly beans and pulls out this monstrosity jelly bean for comparison. That's like at least 10 of those bad boys. And they forgot to bean them in the factory. Kinda look like a lemon. Please don't tell me that's the buttered popcorn flavor. Ugh, the worst one. The perfect avocado doesn't exist. <gasps> Imagine this being the last avocado to ever exist before they go extinct. It's got no seed. How will you make more avocados? It don't matter, it look good. Scoop it out real smooth. I'm still not sure how this is possible for avocado to grow with no seed. Like were you birthed? No, you ain't a mammal. They open up a bag of gummy bears. Wait, 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 wait. Do my eyes deceive me? Because that is not a bear, that is a wizard. They got a gummy wizard. Is this an Easter egg? The equivalent of the golden ticket. But a wizard among bears. He was the one who did it. He was the one who made them gummy. Oh, you know what's a good bag of chips when you pull out a Dorito that looks like this. Mwah! The Cool Ranch one especially, you know that bite's gonna be bussin'. Like when they said add a bit of spice, they really meant it. This is the one you gotta like lick all the spice off of before eating it. Excellent. So someone found this ball inside their bag of Skittles. Super rare mini Skittle. Is this what happens before they blow them up? Before they fill them with the chewy stuff? Y'all can't say you tasted the rainbow until you take a bite out of this. You know, somebody told me all Skittles are the same exact flavor, but they just smell different. So it like tricks your mind. In their bag of gummy bears, they found a gummy bear rope. That's gotta be like 20 of them. Attached. This is what it looks like before they like slice them up. The molds is like stuck. Y'all quality control just like fell asleep. How you let this pass through? It's like a gummy bear worm. Oh, that's pretty cool though. Oh my goodness, they open up their bag of Takis and look. They got the extra, extra seasoning. I will put them through a strainer. Save the excess. Y'all could sell the Taki seasoning on the black market. You know those little cuties? Well, they opened up one and she's pregnant with a child. You eating that little baby inside the mom? Yes, ma'am, the best part. I want to know how a mini cutie growing inside a normal cutie. Imagine pulling this out of your cheeses bag. They forgot to cut it into little pieces. It's like a cheese chip. I bet it's very crunchy. But anyways, that's all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Comment below. Let me know which one of these was the luckiest one. And if you guys enjoyed, make sure to hit that like button the and make sure you turn on notifications. Click, click, and subscribe to the Wolf Pack. Oh, I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys.